Concrete is the second most used material in the world after water. With the world's population estimated to grow to 9 billion by 2050 and 2 billion more people expected to live in cities, 60% of the built environment is not yet built. This represents the equivalent of building New York City every single month. In a circular economy, nothing gets lost. Everything gets reused and recycled in a cradle-to-cradle -cradle approach. By giving a second life to construction and demolition waste, we can preserve Earth's precious resources. I see a great potential in this area when you consider that 1.6 billion people lack access to adequate housing in the world today. The NEST is the largest scale demonstrator to accelerate innovation and research in construction. Together with our 120 partners from academia, business and the public, explore the future of buildings. Concrete is a great material. It's very flexible, it's very performing. It's my belief there is no way without concrete for our future. As the world's global leader in building solutions, we are shaping the future of construction right here and right now. The future is green, the future is circular, the future is digital. Sustainability is a game changer for all of us. That's why I'm putting it at the heart of our strategy. And we are experimenting the next generation of circular products right here, with 50% recycled content inside. This is a cargo ship. And this represents what we are doing in sustainability in La Fache Sim, because it's a journey and as you can see, we are moving. But more than a journey, this one is removing 100 trucks of the road every single day. And this is exactly what we want to do. We want to build a world that works for the people and the planet. In La Fache Sim, we are firmly committed to be part of the solution to solve today's climate crisis. This is why we set the most ambitious 2030 target in our industry, validated by Science Based Target Initiative. Carbon neutral building is within our reach. You can see it happen all around us here. By pioneering new technologies from digitalization to 3D printing, we are shaping the next frontier of green building solutions. But we didn't just look at what's a long term goal, we look at what are we going to do tomorrow morning. So, no time to wait. We must start running right now. By using advanced computational design and engineering, we can model the structure of buildings so that material is only used where it's really needed. It's about optimizing material performance through structural geometry. In the HILO unit, we really want to show the future of construction in concrete. More specifically, we want to show a new way of building sustainably and following the principles of circular economy. I'm excited to work in concrete because you can shape concrete where it wants to be. We developed a concrete with 100% of the aggregates and 50% of the cement made from recycled construction demolition waste without compromise on performance. And concrete is a prime material to offer sustainability targets because it can be reused over and over and over again. What you see behind me right there. This is construction and demolition waste. This is basically an old building. We broke it down in those pieces. We're going to grind it, make it back into powder, straight back in our cement or in our concrete. This is how this year we recycled more than 48 million tons of waste, making us a leading waste treatment company. Our ambition is to reach 100 million tons of waste recycled by 2030. Sustainability is to do a better world for the planet, but also for the people. So let's talk about the people for a second. In Malawi, there is a shortage of 70,000 schools as of today. We are building our first school in 3D printing right there. This is how we can support livelihood with our products. The beauty of concrete is that it doesn't only bring high strength and durability to construction, it is also infinitely recyclable. That's why for me, 
It is the ideal material to build a net zero future. I'm a big believer in the circular economy. The future isn't written, it's built.